I think uh, individually, collectively, we went out and won a championship this year. We've got hardware to show for it. We the player of the year, uh, the coach of the year, first team, second team, academic success, graduation rates, best uh, men's team at WVU. Um, I think uh, collectively this 2018 has been really, really good to our program. And I think uh, 2019, there's gonna be a huge, <laughs> a, a huge uh, bar that's been set for the 2019 group, but um, there's nothing that indicates that the 2019 group can't go over that bar and, and go even further. Yeah, we're losing our best player, but it takes a team to win. You know, Joey doesn't have all the success um, with all the assist records if somebody's not putting the ball in the back of the net and um, he doesn't get the goals unless somebody's setting him up. So I think, uh, I don't know if I've been as excited to get back out in the, on the pitch with the team that we've coming back as I am this year. Usually you go into years going, oh no, how do we do this? How do we do that? Who, how do we replace Joey Piacic? How do we, you know, score goals? Um, how do we stop goals? I've got what I think to be is one of the best goalkeepers in America coming back, one of the most balanced attacks, and one of the, probably the best attacking team in the history of this program that just came through. Um, you know, I think there's a lot that bodes well for us to have an even better 2019. Um, we'll take it stage by stage. The goal is to win the league, um, do enough during the regular season to qualify for the NCAAs, and then win the conference tournament and make a run in a national championship. And I think uh, all those things are realistic for us. And I think every coach will tell you that they want to win a national championship. But I think in 2019, it's a realistic opportunity for us to make a run at things. I think most teams looked at us, looked at our team and saw one superstar. And we looked at ourselves as, you know, 11, 15, 28 superstars. Um, I think that this group has a humility to it um, that no one ever really sees themselves as better than the other. And I think that lends itself well to when you see our group contribute in the way that they contributed. Um, we have a next man up philosophy. Um, somebody goes down, and we trust that whoever we put in is gonna be able to step up. Um, I really just think that the character of our locker room, the, the way the guys interact with each other, the way that they are off the field, really lends itself to being successful on the field. Um, they pick each other up, and it's, it's arguably, I don't even say arguably, it's without a doubt the most well-balanced group that I've had in my 13 years here at WVU, um, where at any moment anybody can, can step up and, and be the big, big player on the day.